Well, howdy folks, Cold Meat 247 here, yes, with part 3 of this Anglin campaign. Uh, we took York in part 2, so if you haven't watched this, uh, well, it's a village, so it's not nothing big, but if you want to watch it, that's in part 2, the annotation is right here. Um, and we gonna actually just skip to the next turn right away. Uh, we're moving to Rain, so if you haven't watched the, the part before, we're moving to Rain to probably take Rain right now. Right now, yeah. Uh, but I'm interested in Paris also because I know the French doesn't have enough troof to, uh, troops to defend everything. So we'll skip the turn right now. I moved everything except for my diplomats. Here we go. One's going uh, north in Italy. The other one is going north towards uh, yeah, towards the, the Danes that we just met actually. Uh, mission take rain. That's uh, pretty good. I thought about maybe moving my army around and going to Paris instead, but with 2,500 uh, 2500 Florence waiting for us, we're gonna go take it in. So the crossbows are gonna hurt. Ow. Oh well. Oh well. But yeah, the crossbows are gonna hurt, but as soon as we're in, that's okay. Nothing, uh, nothing big. Um, I don't know how long that can hold if we can siege it. Four turns. What are we gonna do here? I was training more archers. I'm not gonna wait for those. Uh, I'm gonna go right away. And actually go for two turns of building here, but uh, I'll maintain siege for a while. I might maintain the siege for four turns so they just get out or abdicate or whatever is gonna happen. And uh hmm, wine. Let's go see Paris. As you command. With this merchant. I'll continue once I have rested. Go right. That's great. Okay, uh there's no other construction to do. We can recruit more troops, we're gonna keep recruiting. Spear militia that we're gonna send to Nottingham. And eventually to York to have a decent force here of militia in York. Uh, Nottingham. I have spearmen, but it's more actually archers that I need against the Scots. They don't have any armor, so we're building the bower right now, which is good. So we'll get archers. That's a pretty pretty good there. Um, my turn here in training. I don't really want to train anything else. I might send back some troops here. And then maybe retrain them. I can retrain that. There we go. Um, we're going to keep our main force here in York. Um, I had suggestion to go uh, to go west and take this city here. Uh, but it's rebel right now. So we're just going to keep it as it is. Uh, religion, yes. we're still just at 88, we're gonna stay there, I met the Danes, Is there something I can we'll go for trade rights, do not think it's accepted, that is all. that's excellent, well. uh, and you are gonna probably stay yes, here, sire. so I can have a look at Belouge and uh, Antwerp, and out, you my friend, As you wish. you're going I to see the Holy Roman Empire, we're sieging rain, everything's fine. I want to maybe recruit more bows here. I will have longbowmen coming because I'm doing the right building right here. There we go. So I'm gonna train just one more unit of peasants. Maybe not. Hold on. Yeah, I'll do spears so I can disband the uh, this unit of peasants. That I really don't like to use. Uh, yes, everything is moved. We'll go to the next turn right now. Since we're training everywhere. Yeah, we'll go to the next turn. Turn 6. I'm leaving my spider so I can see the, the Scots army moving around. Let's see here. He still hasn't moved. We'll leave the uh, we'll leave the spy there again. We'll do construction report first. London with the market. 
Um, I can already recruit guards. I'm not looking to have machines right away. I'd like to grow the city a bit faster, and I need money. So, and I'll need spies too. That's a lot of choices right there. Two turns, two turns. We'll do the mines because we have the money. Nottingham, the bower's done, so we can start recruiting archers that we're gonna need. Uh, let's see here. We're on a money. The practice range would have been good. Really good, actually. Alright, cancel the mines in London. Start with a practice range here. And let's see what we can do in London. Well, farm it. That's a good option, anyway. Um. York. Now that we have the wall completed, we have access to the rest of the buildings. So we're gonna be. I put farm already on. But, um. Growing this city is gonna take a while. I will. Or the road, or the green exchange. I have the money to build the grain exchange, so we'll do that. I'm pretty happy with my build order right there. Um, one good thing, if you're doing this campaign, have a look here. There's, there are actually huge uh, rebel armies in those cities. They're hard to take. So it's some kind of a shield here for the other nations not to come through. Um, we're seeing yes, that, the Dane. Yeah. So... Uh, no more recruiting, no more money, we're not gonna move, uh, I'm gonna move actually. I can't move my spear militia because I need my roads. We'll do roads first, so we can recruit militia. Nope, I don't need, well, see that's uh, raising taxes, that's the result of raising taxes, the rebel armies that you have here, but I'm gonna leave them there. The reason is it's it's only one unit. Longbowmen. For this one we will not know right now. I'll sell the priest have a look. Nah, I can't see. It. But nothing uh, nothing really dangerous because it's only one unit. If they're big unit, a big army, don't leave them there. Just don't go clean them up. In this case here, uh, if this is my f the first uh, medieval two gameplay. Uh, that you watch, that I record actually, if it's the first time you watch my Medieval 2 uh, gameplay, I'm gonna show you uh, how to use practice dummies. So this rebel army and this one here will be practice dummies for our spies and our assassins coming out of London uh, in the next couple turns. So we'll skip to the next turn. I'm sieging Irene right now, right now and there's three turns to wait. We'll get trade rights with the Holy Roman Empire. Agreed. I accept you until next time. Uh, bright presented. Yes, we'll so always say yes to that. And we are done in Caen with the. I can actually train longbowmen now. I'm happy. So uh, we're done with the. Uh, the is it the archery range or the bower? So we're done with that. Um, I will eventually turn this into a a town or a city. So I don't want to keep Karen as a castle. Uh, there are be they are better castle here. Toulouse is uh, one of the good one, and it gives you access to the uh, Mediterranean Sea. So that's a good castle. We're gonna keep the rest. We'll turn into cities. We'll keep Nottingham as a castle, just cause you know, and eventually try to get some uh, well um, Sherwood. Archers. Which one is Sherwood Forest, guys? <laughs> I don't think it's with the, uh, It's probably not well represented here, but uh, yes, we'll get some Sherwood Archers from there just for the fun of it. Um, so, can we can uh, probably farm? Can I'm just gonna look here. What's the other? I have York. We'll do the uh, green exchange and we'll farm. Can we're low on money right now? Why? I'll explain. We're losing revenue because of this. 
We're training more troops all the time right now. Yes, my lord. Extra diplomat here. Leaving the fleet side. So you side. are out of here. Uh, I'm gonna send him here. As you wish. No, I might I actually just keep him here. Tomorrow, sire. The reason is, is we're tomorrow gonna get into a war. Out, okay, okay. The reason is, is we're gonna get into a war here with France. Pretty much, pretty soon. If he doesn't protect Paris, we'll go attack Paris. But we, you just attack and then negotiate a ceasefire right after. That's just another strategy to make sure he, he doesn't attack you back. Um, yes, we need to take cities now. There is no choice. I don't think we're gonna wait for rain another turn. Otherwise, we'll lose money. If you look in the uh, which one? Well, if you look in the in your economy, you'll see eventually. I'm probably losing money right now, so I have to get moving quite fast actually. And yeah, I think we'll go disturb the uh, Mister the uh, the. Uh, Let's go. I have archers here. I have three units here. I'm gonna have four units. I'm gonna bring that, 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 and that. So this is gonna move the best it can. I'm gonna put a character inside. To make sure there's no, uh, to make sure we don't lose the, uh, the army, they, they don't turn rebel or anything. So that's uh, 300 of spearmen, 400 of archers. I think we'll bring another one. Might bring this one. It's just town militia. Or we might, we might train a couple more units. And then see what's gonna happen. I'll go on the other side of the city and then protect it from there. I think I can do a lot actually just with that. Uh, or we might get a little bit more light cavalry just so we can crab the, uh, the Scots. So uh, we, I think we can get to the next part here. Yep. We'll get to the next part. Not the next part but the, uh, the next turn. So as you see, I'm not doing a lot of money right now. There's only 900 coming in. But, ooh, land clearance completed. Uh, in Caen. Um, no, it's not even completed there. Where is it? That's in London. Um, I need a border eventually. So we can train agents. But I need more troops. Um, we're gonna train a little bit more spears. Yep. So we'll be. Yes. I can do it with militia and then retrain my militia after that. That'd be a good idea too. So we're gonna train spears and bows. And like cav. And then send that forward. That's uh, that's gonna be our spending for the turn. Yes, my lord. Uh, Mister here, go here. Yes, I'm not using my merchant really. Aaron is worth a lot. So we'll keep. I kept one here. I'm just looking at what's happening with the Dane because I can't see him anymore. Bringing back my ship. And rain is only good for one turn, so the army should get out, and we'll just <laughs> we'll just have, we'll just take them as they just get out of there. What are you doing this then? This. So I have archers. And. I have my Levy Spearmen here ready if I need to reinforce. This is all spear militia. Those two units will stay in the city. We're gonna turn around and maybe push on Anji or see what's gonna happen there. Um I'm pretty happy with my turn right there. I'd say I'd move my army. I can defend. Yeah. I'm gonna move here. Why not? Can't build a tower? I can't build that. Oh, I don't have enough money. Crossbowmen, Welsh spearmen, mercenary cog. You can recruit boats. Um, I leave my army there. 
Keep my spine here to see what's inside. I'm not scared of that. Islanders. Ooh. Yeah. Um, I'm a bit scared of that. But we'll see. We'll keep it that way. So, let's go to turn 9. The French are reinforcing. The forces of Reigns are getting out. Finally. There we go. So, before we actually engage the forces of Reigns, it's a rebel force. Uh, not a lot. As you can see here. Thank you to a friend that remind me of that uh, this command. So this is this is what they have. So it's not much, but it's gonna get out the city. So we're gonna do that in the next part, folks. Part four of this medieval two England campaign. Call me two four seven here. Don't forget to have a look at my channel. I play the other uh, Total War games, and if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Uh, don't forget the comments if you have any question about the game, anything funny to say. Um, I don't mind. Thank you all. Have a good one.